Hi and welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to add a solitaire game like this game on your Joomla website. It is actually not an extension offered by Joomla but I have added it with an iframe to my Joomla website. First thing you need to do is to download the game at the drtmlgoodies.com website. You click on download game and it downloads the game for you. If you have downloaded the game and you install it on the website you will see that it looks like this. This is the actual script with a picture of drtmlgoodies.com in it and the background of drtmlgoodies and this is also how it looks on default. So this is this is how you can uh, see how I changed it. I added the head of Michael in it. I added the background picture of Michael in it. I added a heart to it. And this is how my game looks like now. And I deleted the DRTML goodies that that come text that's uh, that's in here. What did I do to install this? Well, first of all, let me show you the file manager, explorer, and I'm going to look for solitaire here. This is the solitaire game, and this is where I've installed all the files. And if you want to change any of the images, you have to go here and if you downloaded the package, you can just look at them. You can just see what you have to change. Just to show you the HTML goodies, game solitaire, images. Well, actually, this is the card background. Card background too. This, this two images you need to change, and the board with the text need to be changed to the to not display the text the HTML goodies anymore. This is all the, all the cards. I didn't change those. This is the deck. And the BT H's. So those things you can change as well. And af after you have changed it, you have to upload it so that it is replaced on your website. So, and if you have changed the images, you're going to add the game to your website. But how do you add content that's not really from Joomla to your, to your Joomla website? Well, I go to content articles. I'm now in the wrong admin again. I go to content articles. I'm going to look for solitaire. This is actually the solitaire game. I'm clicking on the source code here. And this is the iframe I've used for the solitaire game. I will add that as to this to the description of the studio. Iframe. So I've added a solitaire game and this is how it shows on my website. What I also did is I added a menu item to the to show the to, to show the solitaire game on the website because if you create an article it will not automatically show in your website. So you have to create a menu item so that people will find the article. I will go to main menu. What I did, I clicked on new and 
I added a name solitaire then I click select then I click on article I click on single article I click on select on the select the article and choose solitaire and then I'm going to change the options here page display I don't want to show a page heading that says solitaire so I click on no I click on options I make all, everything go away because I don't want all this stuff in here or oh, you get, the, get what I'm saying and you have to just adjust everything here hide 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 this is how I've done it and then I click on save and I already have created this so, sorry, so I won't do that now and then I also this is actually what I've created and I made it a parent item under the game section normally it's under menu item root but if you want to have it under that other item you have to select it here and you select the games here and you can also select the ordering so if you click first it will show first in the so before chess and if you click quiz it will go after the quiz uh, one like you can see you can also change the ordering I have it on alphabetic for order but you can choose any order you like in the same way I have also added a chess game to my website this is the chess game and this is actually also a script that I found on the internet and I've just added an image of Michael Jackson on the guide so that it fits more in the content of my website I hope you liked this tutorial and I hope you will be back to my channel, to my channel soon to visit more of my tutorials